Today we consider how to resolve HTTP error 503. In our earlier videos, we have provided only one method for resolve this issue. Here we provide two methods for resolve this issue. The first method is by enabling the application pool of your website. For that, let's open IS. And there is a website named web in my IS. If I browse right now, as you can see, I'm getting the error the service is unavailable. Let's check the application pool of this website. The application pool is default application pool. From the list of application pool, if I look at the default application pool, its status is stopped. If I start right now and browse my website once again, the error is resolved. In some cases, enabling application pool is not enough to resolve this issue. In such cases, go to your application pool. Here my application pool is default app pool. Right click, select advanced settings. Under process model tab, you can see there is one property named load user profile. It has true or false value. Now it is true, set it as false and select OK button. And then go to your application pool and start your application pool. After that, browse your website once again. This would definitely resolve your issue. So in this video, we have seen two methods for resolving HTTP error 503. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please visit technomark.in for more information.